oh my God, I can't lose weight without Contrave. Contrave is a mind altering substance. It is a combination of a antidepressant and a, um, an appetite suppressant. So for that reason, I kind of didn't want to do it, but here I am and I'm doing it. Okay. And what I found was that very quickly, especially at proper doses, I was able to very easily talk myself out of stupid shit. Um, driving past Wendy's with the, I'm sorry, but Wendy's makes the absolute best French fries, especially if you get them well done. Um, I like to get the value fries, the smallest possible. It's 200 calories, and I call them diet fries, but that's not good. And in my next vlog, I promise to share with you what it is about fried food, like what specifically it is that kills our effort to release weight, even if all you eat in one day is 500 calories, but that 500 calories was fried? I will tell you why that doesn't work. Oh, so sad. It's such a sad thing. But anyway, so now, okay, so I dicked around with the first bottle, made it last for like three months. The doctor gave me a free bottle. I kind of messed around with that one too, but by the time I got to the end of the free bottle, I was really on a roll. Then I get a prescription for another bottle, and I'm doing it. I'm on it, and I am definitely feeling stuff. I'm seeing stuff. I'm, I'm getting compliments on my body from gorgeous young men, you know what I mean? I'm like, wow, these, these fellas wouldn't say nothing unless there was really something, you know, happening in one eye and stuff and everything and things. Mm. So anyway, I was like, yeah, okay, cool. I was really digging this. I was digging it, digging it, digging it. And I really, I was like, now I'm on this. I'm, I'm doing this. I am doing this. So I ring my doctor. I shoot him a text. I think I shot him a text. I said, hey, can I get a prescription? Or I called his assistant. Somehow I requested a, a new prescription for Contrave. And the response that I got back was, sure, come on into the office. We need to have you stand on the scale and check your weight and make sure that you're losing enough, you know. Um, something along the lines of, um, it was like, if I had not lost enough weight, oops, excuse me, that was like sexy. If I have not lost enough weight, then I would not be given a new prescription for Contrave. Something about that really, really messed with me. First of all, I need to back up. Okay, my scale is broken. It's still broken. It's still broken. I sit at one place. I step on it. And let's say it says 275 pounds. I can move it one inch to the left. Literally, one inch or less to the left. And it'll say 248 pounds. I can move it one inch to the right. And then it'll say... 267 pounds, something, but it's just ridiculous. Within an inch, either direction, I can gain, lose 30, 35 pounds or so. So clearly the thing is broken. I put new batteries in it. It's a relatively new scale. I need a new scale. So now the man is saying, you got to come in, stand on my scale. If you've, you know, if it looks like the contrave is working, then we will absolutely, you know, up that to re up that dose, you know, the prescription, um, or, um, or, you know, or not that freaked me out. So I was like, Oh no. Oh hell no. And up to this point, I had been kind of let, uh, they'd let me just kind of like, you know, do my thing. <laughs> so I wasn't expecting this. And now all of a sudden I get real serious with it and you do. Oh no. <sighs> so Something made me really uncomfortable with that. Partly it was because I wasn't completely confident about how much weight I'd lost. Been working out a lot more, which is another thing. For the first time in this effort, I was not only eating right, but working out to where I sweat like an hour a day with the fitness marshal. I mean, dancing so hard, just drenched, not cute, rock on. I was doing that kind of thing. And, um... So, and, and eating right. So that, like putting them both together, you, for the longest time, I would just eat right. And the, and the weight would slowly, very, very slowly, you know, go. 
but now I was working out too and taking my walks, rocking my new Fitbit. Yeah. So, okay. I, I text back and, um, it's on the phone that I'm using to, um, record this. So I can't tell you, but basically I said, I can't find the words, but I thank you so much for, um, making an appointment for me to come in tomorrow morning. But I, I, I really need the, the standing on the scale thing to be voluntary and, um, can't find the words for why, but that's the way I feel about that. So for the time being, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to wean myself from the contrave. And, um, and then in about a month after my birthday, my birthday is June 11th, y'all. Okay. I was just saying, anyway, um, after my birthday, I'll come in and, uh, for my physical and I'll step on your scale at that point. I just put it like that. And so he wrote me back and he's like, well, we just want to make sure that you're okay. You know, we just want to make sure you're healthy and safe and stuff. And I, and I, you know, smiled, sent a heart back or something like that. But I was still like, ah. then great big cow tears fell out of my eyeballs. So I'm sitting here because I'm like, holy smokes. This is actually working for me. And now I'm going to not do it. Really? Or I'm, I'm, I'm doing this thing that is actually finally working for me. And there's a possibility that somebody could take it away from me. Uh, that didn't work for me either. So this great big, like, poof, poof, poof. um, it reminded me, I'm like, God, you know, um, when you have VSG, nobody can take that away from you afterwards. You know what I mean? Um, so I'm like, damn it. <laughs> so I decided I'm going to wean from the contrary, but I want you to know that in the first three or four days, I did stupid stuff that I have not done in months. I had one bag of Lay's potato chips. I had, it was two things. I had, oh, two orders of French fries, uh, Wendy's, mm -hmm, diet fries. Uh, and I had, um, I had something else. And I wrote my doctor about that. I'm like, I had this, this, that, that, and that. And I haven't had those things. I haven't even wanted those things. Then all of a sudden, um, as I was coming off of it, my, um, nighttime, thing the 10 o'clock head hunger Ugh. okay so I'm really like watching myself um watching myself as as I am um morphing into <laughs> off the contrave um and just kind of wondering what's happening so one of the first things I noticed is like okay first I did cry and first um one of the thoughts that I had was oh my god I can't lose weight without contrave, you know? I'm sorry. That's BS. When I heard myself think that, that's a problem. That's a problem for me. Please come back and I want to talk to you more about contrave and what I've learned about this, um, this diet. Uh, um, pill? This VSG in a pill. <laughs> I really want to share this. It's important. I'll talk to you in just a few.